Come on, let's go. Sure. to get up again. Hey you, be careful. This island is dangerous. Of course it is. It's the pirate's headquarters. Home to the notorious pirate Admiral Alvarez. Yeah, but I'm talking really dangerous. Yeah? What exactly? Have you seen it? Evil itself roams the island. Hellhounds have overrun the entire town. How do you know the harbor town is being attacked? I've been watching it. It's bad, believe me. Many were killed, and many have fled. The road from here into the town is guarded by some of those terrifying hellhounds. To be honest, I wasn't brave enough to take up the fight against them. You're no pirate. What are you doing here on Antigua? I'm a guardian, protector of magic and servant of the High Mages on Tyrannis. I was sent here with the mission of obtaining as many magic crystals as possible. Interesting. Look, I'd really love to stay and chat, but... Yes? My orders are taking up all my time. Come with me. I'll take you there. But what about the Hellhounds? We'll be ready for them. Are you sure? Yeah, now come on. Okay. But on your head be it. See any of them again? This is supposed to be a graveyard. I've seen graveyards that were four times this size. There were at least four people for every gravestone. This graveyard is just wasting space.
All right. This is it? Yeah. The harbour town of Antigua. What have I got myself into? Well, it's no use. Thank you for your help. Here, take this. I'll try and sell my wares here. If you need anything else, you'll find me at the marketplace. The wonderful town of Antigua, where virgins are traded and pirates' livers are pickled in rum. I thought the island was called Antigua. The town is too! This is Antigua! On mine. Antigua! Don't ask. Last, where the bloody hell have you been? I've been waiting for days. Happy to see you too. Cut the crap, where were you? I was hunting for treasure on the Crab Coast. What took you so long? Fuck all, really. I just died. What? Well, I was dead. I hope you can elaborate. Let's discuss this. Come, tell me exactly what happened. A rock cave? Not rock. It comes from the depths of the Earth, driven by the power of the Underworld. At the end of the cave was a portal of crystal. The Shadow Creatures use these portals to get across to the other side. They receive their orders from the Lords of the Underworld through the portals. The Hellhounds. Not just them. Creatures that are much worse come through the portals. Unfortunately, that's not the only problem we have. Not a single ship has come into port in weeks. It's as if we've been cut off from the world. We saw a fleet of ghost ships on our way here. Ghost ships? It's Crow. Back from the underworld. I feared as much. The ancient curse is catching up with us. Oh, come on. Spare me. When you see dogs run out of explanations, you always come up with a fucking story about curses. Who has such power? You need to find out before we are done for. I need provisions and equipment. You know what's going on out there. Take care of those hellhounds before they kill us all. Wonderful. Hellhounds, just what I like. Look for survivors. They should help you find them. Those hounds have made themselves comfortable almost everywhere. What are the casualties? So far, I've only seen the corpse of Donovan the gunsmith in the square. I've no idea who lives. Get down there and help before there are more deaths. Where should I look for the Hellhounds? Emma's fighting them on the beach in the east. Check Flynn's warehouse and Blood Oath Square, where Zack is patrolling. Look in the marketplace and visit Grace at the forge. I also saw some of them on my way in from the western beach. I have killed several of the Hellhounds already. Where, exactly? I found several on the way here from the western beach. And? Are they dead? Of course. Good work. Antigua is going down the fucking drain. You're going to get into trouble sooner or later.
Alvarez's humble abode. I thought they chopped the old pirate's head off long ago. His mountain of debt drove him from Antigua. On his last night, he told everyone that he had found a gilded orb and was planning to head to Tyrannus. When he came back, he had an enormous sack full of gold. Hmm. We'll talk later. First, take care of the Hellhounds. Show that beast. Put that thing away. Much worse. This, a bit of that. Oh, come on, spare me. Just show me what you've got.
sorry to get Stop up Stop right there, you fiend. Hold it. I'm not going to hurt you. Ugh, I knew it. You're one of those horrible minions. Why are you loitering? Yes, I do indeed run this forge, and no, I do not provide any other services. Not even when times are tough. Calm down. You seem tense. And why is that, I wonder? Nobody believes I can run the forge on my own. And? Are they right? <sighs> Since that good-for-nothing Wilson abandoned me, everything has ground to a halt. Our port is being overrun and nobody's coming to our aid. And now I have to look after this apprentice, Ansel. It's just too much for me. Why did Wilson leave? That's something I'd like to know. How could he prioritize something over me? Piss off. Go to Kalidor and join the Demon Hunters. What has he won with the Demon Hunters? Who knows? Forging cannons or one of those things men do. He'd better not be involved with some trollop. Hey, you're a seaman, aren't you? Could you give my husband a message? It's so hard to find a suitable messenger for such personal messages these days. I'd really like to know how my Wilson is doing. About Wilson... What do I get if I deliver your message? How about a little kiss? I... uh... I'd rather not. <laughs> you don't know what you're missing. Just 200 gold, then. So, where on Kalidor is Wilson? I think you'd be best advised to look for him at a forge. He could be there. I'd never have guessed. Give me the message. I'll take it to Wilson. But don't crumple it up. Oh, and I won't eat it either. Now give it to me. Here it is. Have a good trip. Got anything to sell? Yes, but only when Pansel is back in the forge. And he can't get back while those damn creatures are around. Oi, watch where you're treading. Why should I? Why do you think? It's dangerous here. Thanks for the advice. Aye, it'll save your skin. The bird at the harbor, Scarlet, got it too. And Donovan's not come down from his room in a while either. There was nothing we could do. Bad conscience because of Scarlet. Yeah. And why? Was responsible for her. You have to worm every word out of his nose. Are you waiting here for something? Aye. And what would that be? The right moment. To do what? To knock some creatures flat. Where exactly? Over there. How many creatures are there? You are really beginning to get on my nerves. Get to the point. Only if you finally shut up. There are a few beasts in Blood Oath Square. They need a kicking. The beasts in Blood Oath Square have had it. About time. Good. Here for your effort. If your finger isn't long enough, use a small, fine pair of tongs. It will let you reach the object of your desire more easily. Only skilled blacksmiths can make them. I knew one on Tyrannis. Gordon, he was called. I'll remember that. Blood Oath Square, a sacrificial altar in the meadow. 
The shadows are ravaging the lands. We're bashing each other's heads over stolen potatoes? Gotta have your priorities. Looks like it. Who else is here, apart from you and the pirates? I think I saw a demon hunter. Demon hunter? That's what I said. He was also headed to the town. I'd check the local tavern. You might find him there. Why are you looking for magic crystals on Antigua of all places? They don't occur naturally here. That's true. However, they are rare crystals. The perfect treasure for pirates. The mages asked me to search near the pirates and find three specific crystals on Antigua. What's so interesting about these... crystals? They are the source of our power. We need the crystals to work our magic. Why three crystals? Antigua is a small island. If there are any magic crystals here at all, it'll only be a handful of them. Finding just three of them would be an achievement. So you're only here because of the crystals? And to trade, of course. Even if pirates aren't the best business partners. I guess you know what you're doing. I should hope so. Where do you want to search for the magic crystals? I have no idea. But I bet the pirates know something about them. Right. I reckon I'm gonna have to help you with your search for crystals. Why? Don't you think I can handle it? Honestly? Or do you want me to be polite? What's that supposed to mean? Aren't you afraid of the pirates? Nonsense. Why should I be? I'm a pilgrim sent by the High Mages. Alright, hang on. Just so I understand. You're an outsider here on Antigua, right? Uh, yes. Have I got this right? A total stranger trying to steal treasure from the nastiest bastards on the southern seas and on their own island. What the fuck? Yes, but... Do us both a favor and forget your plan. It's shit. But how am I supposed to... You'd better let me do it. Or you won't leave this island alive, my friend. Uh... All right then, if you say so. Show me your stuff. Sure. Here.
I'm going to make a hat out of your skin! I know nothing about crystal magic. Thanks. I thought I'd have to rot here forever. How did you manage to free me? No idea. My encounter with the Shadow Lord at Crab Coast could have something to do with it. A Shadow Lord? There's something that's even worse than those minions. Wouldn't you like to know? Okay. I don't really want to know all the details. Why were you detained here? How should I know? It's not like I could ask. I was simply overpowered by minions, and before I knew it, I was captured. Still, they kept me alive. But what about my goods? Tell me more about you. Well, when I'm not a captive, I'm in charge of the warehouse. I've only had the post for a short while. No idea what happened to my predecessor. Right. So if you need anything, I'm your man. Always good to know there's a merchant nearby. Camp Overseer? That sounds boring. I used to work as a swineherd. You stink like shit and the whores won't take you upstairs. Managing crates is the better option. Exactly. Ever heard of magic crystals? Yeah. Really? Yeah. But I have a little problem that needs sorting out. And as long as it remains, I won't have anything for you. Your hellhounds in the warehouse are history. Good news. Right. I've got something for you. On the top floor of the warehouse, there's a battered old chest. There are some crystals in it. Some old bloke, I've forgotten his name, claimed they were magic. <laughs> I see. It's probably rubbish, but 
They're beautiful crystals. Take them. You can probably make better use of them than me. All right then. Thanks. I'm not good enough yet. Do you have anything else for me to do? Hmm. Now that you're asking, my brother Quinn owns a sword fragment that I'd like to have. Bring it to me and your pockets will be filled with gold. Where is he? That is a good question. That scumbag is far away from here. Went on about an island with natives. Kira... Kiba... Keela! Yes, that's it, Keela. Good. I'll keep my eyes peeled. I'll get you the sword fragment. Good. A person like you will go far. You don't say. I was here, the warehouse was still in one piece. Could be because of the Hellhounds. That's no reason to burn down your warehouse, idiot. You're not- We're not gonna survive this. One, beat it! Get lost! Piss off! I'm slowly getting used to it. Rim. Sounds like something is weighing on your mind. I'm not well at the moment. No hard feelings. That's true for many of us. What's the situation on the west coast of Antigua? It's overrun by the shadows. I'm glad I was in town when it all kicked off. The earth shook and there were deafening sounds was fucking terrible. Have you got any wise advice for me? There are outsiders on Antigua. Demon hunters and followers of magic. Maybe you should listen to what they have to say. I think they might be useful to us. That's probably true. Hey, you old swashbuckler. Well, fancy seeing you again. The place is going to ratchet and you're still gallivanting around. By the way, Alvarez wants to talk to you. Yeah, I already spoke to him. Why don't you tell me what's been going on in the tavern instead? Ah, uh, you know, a few loitering louts here, a few drunken pigs there. Same old, same old. Oh yeah? Of course it fucking isn't. 
Take a look outside, you dimwit. That almost sounds comforting. You got something to drink for me? Sure. You know how it works. If you pay, you get whatever you want. What's new? Hey, this is Antigua. There's always something new. What do you want to know? What's the situation like inland? Word has it that it's bad. There are rumors of strange black earth that keeps spreading. I don't know if it's true, but I ain't been there since the shadows arrived. How did you fare when the minions attacked? I was lucky. The tavern provides good protection. It won't hold forever, but we'll give them a run for their gold. But the others weren't so lucky. I haven't heard from Flynn, but hopefully he's safe in the warehouse. And as for Emmer, the Eastern Shore was the first to be overrun. I'd go check up on her, but it's too dangerous. You don't have any magic crystals by any chance. Magic? <laughs> nah, but you could check the warehouse or ask Alvarez. Thanks. Flynn's doing fine. Uh, glad to hear that. Guess he avoided the creatures. Unfortunately not. Running away was no longer an option for him. What? He didn't eat his legs, did they? No, he still got them. He was trapped in some kind of magical barrier. You worried me. Can you teach me something? We'll see. And how about you? Ah, uh, let me guess. You lost your family in the war, you just happened to land in this mess, and none of it's your fault. What did he say? He thinks we're a bunch of vagabonds! Oh yeah, I forgot. Of course, you almost starved to death. Just a few coins, that's all you need. Isn't that right? I can always use more gold. Unfortunately, I have to disappoint you. I was robbed of all my possessions three days ago. Big words! So bugger off. A little pissed off, are we? Allow me to rephrase. I'd like to drink my beer in peace and have no intention of speaking to random vagrants. Got it? Vagrants? What else would you be? Don't get worked up. What could you have possibly done that would be of any interest to me? I was brought back from the dead. Uh-huh. Back from the dead, huh? Now that's plausible. Uh, that really sets you apart from the other windbags around here. Oh, all right. If it'll get you off my back, what do you want? I guess you're not one of the local pirates. How dare you. Do I look local? So why are you here? I, um, got lost. Right. Actually, I was following my destiny. I can't describe it any better. Destiny called me to this forsaken island. And I obeyed. Oh, come on. You don't look like you believe that kind of stuff. Destiny, in my experience, is something you make happen. All right. You've roused my curiosity. So who are you? I am someone who stands up against the underworld. Well, if you are who you say you are, you might just be the man I'm looking for. If you treat everyone this friendly, I'm not surprised you haven't found anyone yet. So what do you want? I fear the Hellhounds are merely the harbingers of a far greater threat. But the demon warriors are approaching from the north. I want to see them and find out if they are as demonic as the rumors suggest. Do you feel up to the task? Where to? We'll start at the edge of town. We'll discuss what to do when we get there. Rough up some demons in the hinterlands. I'm with you. What do you say? 
Oh, all right. Better than rotting here in this hole in the ground. I don't know about you, but I'm not squeamish. I'll be right behind you. Hmm. That's what I'm worried about. Then you go first. I'll follow. But don't make me wait for you. Let's go. Come on. We've got business. I've got a bad feeling about him. That's reassuring. Let's move on. I think it's going to be dangerous from here on. Wait. Are you scared? Who's asking? I just wanted to be sure that you don't run during the first proper fight. Shut your mouth and keep moving. Just stay close behind me. Official meat. That's it for you, you foul beast. Intricate lock. Come on, keep going. Unpleasant here. Yeah. This isn't the Antigua I once knew. Someone was thorough. The shadows. The black land continues to spread. Come on, we'll take a closer look. Let's move on. Come on, keep going. Not another damn shadow. <laughs>
Let's move on. Your skin! Yeah. 